I am complicit sunshine. <laughs> <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is Anna and welcome to my world. Today we'll be taking a tour of Salzburg, Austria, visiting the filming locations to a family classic, The Sound of Music. But before we get started, please subscribe and click the notification bell. Salzburg, it's the fourth largest city in Austria, the birthplace of Mozart, and the setting for a classic musical film adapted from the stage musical by the dynamic duo of Rodgers and Hammerstein. The Sound of Music was released in 1965, and we will be visiting some of the filming locations around Salzburg. In the movie, Marie is a postulant at Nonberg Abbey before becoming a governess for the Von Trapp children. Nonberg Abbey is the oldest continuously existing nunnery in the German-speaking world and a UNESCO World Heritage Site since 1996. Residence Plot is at the heart of Salzburg's old city. The fountain is considered to be the most beautiful in the city with horses and dolphins. The movie uses two houses for Villa von Trapp. I am confident sunshine. <laughs> Is it ready? Oh. Okay, so we're here. Okay, we're done. Okay, Audrey, go run and skip. skip. You know how to skip? I have confidence in the sunshine. The front entrance is Schloss Fronberg, a concert venue and rehearsal site for a university in Salzburg. It becomes a hostel to the general public during the summer. Mozart Bridge is an Art Nouveau pedestrian bridge in the city center built in 1903. We are on our way to the horse pond, one of the places the children and Maria visited while singing Do Re Mi. The square is in the historic district while the pond was originally used to wash parade horses of the Prince Archbishop. I mentioned earlier that two mansions were used for Villa von Trapp. Schloss Leopoldskron was used for the lake and terrace seats. The Rococo Palace is now a hotel and serves as our accommodation in Salzburg. Let's see if the interior is the same as the movie. Unfortunately, it's not. Most of the interior scenes were filmed in a Hollywood studio. There is a room in the Schloss that inspired the ballroom scene. Let's check it out. The Venetian room was the inspiration for the ballroom and recreated in a Hollywood studio. This was also the setting of my favorite scene, the lonely goat herd marionette. This elegant room has painted walls and mirrors framed by golden wood panels. I'll briefly show a room in the Schloss, which was not in the movie, but was named after a person who played an important role in Austrian theater and Hollywood movies. This is the Max Reinhardt Library. Max Reinhardt was an Austrian-born theater director and his descendants were the owner of the palace during the filming of The Sound of Music. Go outside and see the terrace and pond. The door is quite heavy and hard to open. There are a couple of memorable outdoor scenes filmed at the palace. Here's the lake where the Von Trapp children fell in after their adventures around the city of Salzburg. They were later reprimanded by their father. Remember the two horses guarding the gate?
55 years after the release of the movie, and the horses are still at the same place. And of course, an obligatory picture for the travel scrapbook. Whether you're 16 going on 17 or 70 years old, you'll recognize this structure. It was originally at Schloss Leopoldskron, but moved to the Sound of Music Park due to trespassers. The gazebo remains locked because visitors in the past tried to recreate the dance scene and ultimately injured themselves in the process. Lastly, we're going to drive 20 minutes west of Salzburg to the town of Monzi. Monzi is located on the shore of Lake Monzi and is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. St. Michael's Basilica serves as the site of the wedding of Maria and Captain Von Trapp. It was a tiring but adventurous day. We went to many filming locations around the city of Salzburg and there's more places to visit. I suggest checking out the city for yourself, whether you're a fan of the movie or not. To celebrate, here's a crisp apple strudel with vanilla sauce to end the day. Coming up next, but more department store in Kawasaki, Japan, and right behind me is the world's shortest escalator ride. Thank you for watching the video. Please don't forget to give us a like, comment, and subscribe. And follow us on Instagram, World of Fun and Travel. From Salzburg, Austria. See you again next time. Goodbye.